All right, Leo, pick it up. Way to go, Leo! Let's go, Leo! There you go, Leo! One lap to go, and here they go, UC, CBA. St. Peter's trying to hang on with them. Feel me exciting race. Hear the crowd chanting. And CBA is going for the move. 200 to go. You Catholic giving it all he's got. And the final stretch. 100 meters to go. Wow. Incredible. Incredible race by all these gentlemen. Insane. Let's go, Leo! Woo! Yeah!
Sometimes be challenging to be the leader here because look behind, you got a pack of six that can work together to pull you back a bit. Meanwhile, Mantel is kind of all out on his lonesome here. Cumberland, Rhode Island. There's Union Catholic again. They have two teams in this race as well, with another team coming up in that second heat. Leo Wisniewski. It's where you see serious depth. If you have eight milers. They can help you qualify two teams to a four by mile championship here at New Balance Nationals. You have an outstanding program with serious top to bottom depth. Cumberland hadn't been anywhere close to the front until this third leg as we see some jockeying going on in that chase pack. Wisniewski got bumped a bit as he worked his way around Tevin McLaren of Corning. So it's Cumberland brothers and Corning and we are winding our way closer to this final leg. Deep into this final lap of the third leg of four. And it is Tevin McLaren of Corning who has surged the Hawks out in front. Corning also has a strong girls team that will run in the girls four by mile championship coming up after the boys four by mile be some serious hardware for that school today. Wisniewski of Union Catholic kicking to the outside at the end of his leg trying to gain some positioning. Westfield's gotten a strong third leg from Liam Murillo that has brought them up into second. Thank <laughs> you. 